guys and today is the last of September which means it's time for my September favorites video and I know I have missed three favorites videos in a row I missed June, July and August but to be fair they were in such an inconvenient time for me to film because I've been traveling and whenever it came to the end of the month and the beginning of the next month I was in the travel I didn't have an internet and that's why I haven't done them but this time I'm back with a September favorites video and it's also like a favorites overall because I've missed so many favorites my first things are the things that I bought in June but ever since I've been obsessed I've been wearing them for the entire summer and now in the month of September I've been wearing them loads as well and they are the Revlon Colorburst Mud Bombs and I know when they came out because they came out quite recently a few months ago now but the hype about them was really big but I haven't had a chance to talk about them on my channel just yet so now I'm talking about them and I do really love them they are basically the jumbo size lip crayons and yeah they look like that and they are matte bombs so they are matte but firstly when you apply them on your lips they look quite satiny and glossy but the gloss wears off within like a half an hour to an hour and then they end them being completely matte on your lips and they last for a few hours as well which I love about them they last quite a while and firstly I purchased this one this one is in the shade complex and it is nude so obviously I purchased my nude first because I love nudes and this one is quite a dark nude as you can see but then I purchased these two together and this one is just the pink one and it's called elusive and just this beautiful pink color and this one is a very bright orange one which was perfect for the summer I've been wearing this loads during the summer it's not very wearable right now but for spring and summer this color is perfect and it's called audacious and as you can see it's very bright orange neon orange colors so yeah I love them free the only thing I would say with these two is that they are a little bit hard to wear like I would suggest exfoliating before putting this on like I would suggest using a lip scrub on your lips before putting these two on because they won't look nice when you have dry patches on your lips they will kind of accentuate them but with this one this one is my favorite the elusive one because this doesn't do that this one is a little bit more smoother and yeah even though when you have dry chapped lips this won't go into like fine lines or anything so this one is my favorite but overall I've been loving free my second thing is a mascara and I'm pretty surprised that I haven't tried this mascara before because I had lots of youtubers talking about this quite a while back because it is definitely not the newest mascara it's been out for years but it is my first time trying it and honestly I'm not even kidding ever since I purchased it at the end of July I think every time I wore makeup and I wore mascara it was this one that's how much I love it and I don't know I probably even like it more than the falsies by Maybelline this is the day to night mascara from Remo and it looks like that it's just so good I first used the volumizing wand which is opposite to what they say but I think the volumizing wand works better to be applied first and then the lengthening so this is the volumizing wand it's a little bit thicker and first I applied that and then I apply the lengthening wand which is a lot thinner but this one actually makes such a big difference because it does lengthen your lashes a lot and it makes a big difference I think this mascara is quite dramatic and I love that I love very dramatic lashes but it's not clumpy or spidery it's just very dramatic so it's perfect for my life it's not natural but it's really nice and I would highly recommend you guys to go and try this out now this next thing has been so 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 useful for me when I was traveling basically I took it anywhere with me where I was traveling and it is this powder tree by soap and glory and basically look how nice and very good for traveling this is this is like in the shape of a book and you can put it just at the back of your rucksack it won't take much space because it is very slim and flat and then inside you have this massive mirror which is pretty much what I've been using every single day to do my makeup when I was traveling it also comes with a bronzer a highlighter and a blush so you have like three in one and a mirror like the mirror is probably the main reason why I like it so much because it's so big and so good to do your makeup and you don't have to because not every single place where you go to will have good mirror that you can then sit down somewhere and do your makeup sometimes you will have to stand and do your makeup and I really don't like standing and doing my makeup I would rather just sit down and you know have this mirror in front of me and then do my makeup like that and yeah the powders also are very good quality my favorite one out of them I would say is this blush it is love at first blush and I will show you how it looks. I will just do a little swatch. That's how it looks on my finger. So it's very shimmery, very nice, 
baby pink color and that's how it looks on my hand. I just think it's such a beautiful blush and just overall this set has been working wonderful for me. I honestly feel like Soap and Glory is a total winner for me this month because my next favorite is also from Soap and Glory and it is The Righteous Butter. This is my favorite body butter of all time right now. I just, the scent is amazing, the consistency is amazing. If you have dry skin, this is very thick and moisturizing and nice, but it doesn't take forever to dry, so that's really good as well because I hate feeling greasy for a long time. This dries quite quickly, but it's still very thick and moisturizing. But it's a very thick formula, but oh my god, it smells so nice. But this smell, I've never smelled anything like that before. Like, I can't even describe the scent because I have never smelled anything like that. But basically in the morning, after you take shower, you should definitely try using this because then you will smell like this body butter for the entire day and you may even get compliments because I did get compliments when I was wearing this after I took shower the same day. So that's, I think, is great and says on it with souvenir shea butter and aloe vera. My next favorite is a nail polish and this may not be a surprise to loads of you but this is China Glaze Electric Beat Nail Polish. It's a blue, perfect blue color. I love the color on this. It's like not too bright and not too dark. I think it's perfect for this season because it's something in between the bright blue and the dark blue color and I love the consistency of this. I love how thick it is and how only you need only one coat of this to make it look all nice and then it dries really quick and it lasts forever as well. I know China Glaze is a little bit of a hit and miss because I have purchased another one, the red one that I was wearing in my previous video and that one was nice as well but it chipped a lot more than this one. This one I was able to wear for the entire week straight and I didn't have a single chip in it. For my jewelry favorites I've been absolutely loving anklets because I think they look perfect with like rolled up jeans or disco pants and then like flats or brogues or maybe vans I think they look so super cute and like make outfit instantly more fancy looking and my favorite one is this one and this one I received as a gift it's a silver one and it looks like that it has basically these two chains with like nice beads and looks so 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 amazing and also has a bell and I don't know how I feel about this one because it does jingle and I feel like a sheep whenever I wear this and jingle like that so I don't know because you know how sheeps have the bell around their necks and I just feel like a sheep I don't know so I sometimes tuck it in into my socks so that then it won't jingle but my friend said it was cute like she's into anklets as well but has don't have a bell and she said wow I wish mine would have bell because it's so super cute I don't find it cute I like I like to tuck this bell in most of the time so I won't jingle but other from that I just absolutely love this I think it, this looks so so beautiful and in general I've been so into anklets this month and they have to be a big big favorite of mine okay and my last favorite for this month is a makeup brush and this is the one from Inglot and I swear whenever I purchase Inglot brushes they always end up being in my favorites or something because they're so amazing such a good quality very lightweight and I just love them this one is the Inglot 3P brush and it looks like that. It's basically an angled, very fluffy brush, not very dense at all, great for blending and just a perfect shape for contouring. Basically, I've been contouring with this quite a lot and I just think it's perfect to go underneath your cheekbone and then to then blend upward. And if you are looking for a good contour brush, then I would highly recommend this one. I know it's not the cheapest because Inglot is a high-end company, so the brushes aren't the cheapest, but they are so totally worth it because it's a long time purchase unless you want to take care of them they will last you for a long long time this one hasn't shed one bit I used this this morning and I was thinking wow I can't show you that dirty brush because it looked quite dirty after I used it so I was thinking why well, I have to wash it before this video and I have and it took half an hour before this was dried and ready to use for the video so again I think it's so convenient say in the morning if you need to do your makeup but you have dirty brush like that you can wash it really quick wait half an hour and you'll be able to use it okay guys so that is the end thank you so much for watching hope you enjoyed if you did then please like this video and subscribe to me if you're not already and i'll see my next one bye